Hello everybody and welcome back to my time at Sandrock where we have now finished Oh, it was awesome last episode, wasn't it? But we have now finished the um, the section of story for this patch. Um, so we're not going to have any more main story quests until next patch. Which hopefully should arrive fairly soon. Oh, I shut up with your sunscreen nonsense, Pablo. <laughs> but um, it's important to wear sunscreen, guys. But... Uh, Nothing wrong with my skin. Pablo's just being mean. So anyway, so yeah, I'm uh, gonna be <laughs> gonna be basically now focusing down on um, things like getting people to like me. And someone in the comments was very much saying, "I just want to check something on Rosie a second. I want to check if Rosie has a party ship." Yes, so the only thing that Rosie doesn't have right now is pet management and mount management. So if I see them anywhere, I'll grab them, but where do we get them? Mole cave, you foul salvage company. Alright, let's go to you foul salvage company very quickly. Um, but she does have a party chip. Rosie has a party chip. So, like, um... I... I'm just going to want to go because my plan today is to get a banquet table and have party and start to manage parties uh, using Rosie. So I wanted to know whether I'd need a chip for that, but apparently I do not. So harvesting, planting, machine collection. Well, harvesting, machine collection, planting, harvesting. There's no pet management here. Also, I have given like Rosie both a harvesting and a planting chip, I believe, and yet no planting or harvesting is really being done, so I'm not quite sure. And I think I did even set up planting, so I'm not really sure what's going on there anyway. <laughs> They've definitely said you foul a salvage company for pet management chip. Makeover. So look at what I've assigned. Help a log. Huh? Why have you got nothing assigned? Oh no, no, you do, you do. It's okay. Party catering. See, it, I think this is the thing here. There's pet, you've got pet animals, that's fine. Collect machine goods, collect produce, clean barn. I think Rosie needs a bit of a tweak, honestly. That's all fine. Add fuel, add water, clear sand, clear sand. Um, I definitely want the fuel and water to be added. That's definitely 100% a thing that I need. Collecting machine goods is another one that's really important. Petting animals, yes. Collecting, produce and cleaning the barn, yes. So probably I would take off the cleaning sand and put in party catering. Let's just confirm that. And so what I would then like to do... That'd be cool if I could have another helper, actually, wouldn't it? What I would then like to do is I'm going to head off to the game centre, actually. Lightning, you can... You can come with me. You can help me go there a bit faster. And I want... Uh, this is where I believe... Oh, I, I, although I will check with Heidi first. I want to check all the things that Heidi has as well. Because I really do want to start to decorate my yard. My yard looks so, like, bare. So it would be really cool if I could start to get things to decorate it. But I am having to focus a lot on, on the sheer amount of money you need to upgrade as well. So let's have a little, little, little look. So that's the catalogue. I think it's the shop I would want. Stone, Dina, marble, an elegant swing. 
That gives 167 HP. Which is quite good. 10 defense points for an elegant flower box. That might be a good way to split things up though, with flower boxes. Oh, you can just buy animal houses, you don't have to make them. Amazing. Yak boy swing, that gives quite a bit as well, so... 192, and it's actually, the yak boy one is better. And a pergola, which gives me actually defense points, okay. Let's have a look in the catalogue and see what that's all about. I think that might be the same as my, yeah. Majestic style room. That's new. Okay, so Heidi doesn't have an awful lot and she also doesn't have, um, I did want to check she didn't have a banqueting table first. I believe there's a few things um, that are rewards. I will check over at the general store as well. Just to make sure, like, what, what furniture items do we have here? Quite a few different things. Extra attack, extra luck, there's all sorts. So I do want to, like, try and buy a few different bits and pieces. And try and just up the stats in my house. I'll have a look at them in just a second. But I'm fairly certain, I'm almost... 100% positive that I'm not gonna already have 100% stats um, because I've upgraded the yard so many times. I did put a bit of furniture down when I died last episode just to try and give myself a few more hit points but I only put down the furniture that I happened to have in my chest that I hadn't been putting down for ages so that was you know that was needed anyway but I haven't bought anything new. Who are you? Avery. Why don't you have the most dashing golden eyes? Is Avery maybe one of the like free cities people that came to help? I've got a feeling. Oh, Meerkat, hello. Still trying to give as many gifts as I can to the animals that are not uh, yet my friends. is uh, absolutely another thing that's going to happen there. Um, I'm going to go over to the Golden Goose. And we're going to get the, the reason I want to get the banqueting table first, rather than going to do extra commissions first, or going to do... Oh, you know what? It's Friday as well. You know what Friday means? Friday means it's Fang Day. Let's, do, let's go do a clinical trial with Fang. Try that one. That one was good last time, but it didn't work this time. Did it completely wakey, knock me wakey. out? Wakey, wakey. Noted. Can I do more? Ah, uh, tried too many times this week. Okay, that's fine. I had one success story, but you get plus three with Fang every time you do that, so it does give you like a little bit. Of help. Oh, look, speaking to him gets plus two now. Evil doers must be punished. Well done. Oh, right, that was plus two for for that. Okay. You test subject. Sub <coughs> but until you can get Fang to like level one or so, I don't think he even accepts a gift or possibly even an invite to a banquet. I'm not even sure about that. Let's have a look at him. So there's loads of people that are really high up. I've got two pets already. Meerkat's getting really close. So is Macchiato. Um, but X and Fang. Fang is actually at like almost one heart. So Fang is almost an associate. Very close. But Zeke and Mort and all them. Zeke I should probably just be doing more quests for, to be honest. Like on the, the planting section. Uh, Ryan didn't come into this until a little bit later. Whether Ryan will be in right at the start, I'm not really sure next time, but uh, most of these guys, except for like Jan, Venti, and Andy, like Pebbles and the Magic Mirror and stuff. So I need to be giving Rosie um, a lot more presents, I think. Because <laughs> Rosie and the animals are going to be the ones that I can't really, like, say, 
invite to a banquet or take out for um, for a play date or anything like that to try and improve things. So they're going to have to be given gifts, I think. So that, especially in the next run, that's what I'm going to be focusing on a lot earlier. I think it's going to be some social. Because that's going to bring in social story aspects that I'm going to want to see. Especially uh, before I progress the... Especially with Matilda, Penn, Yan. All the spies, basically. I want them to be good friends with me. <laughs> Ironically, by the time they become... They show their hands as... Tip their hands as spies, basically. Like, Ryan I can't even do anything with. Or Haru, because they're all away at the moment. I don't know why I'm riding up here. We need to get into the... I've already lost enough time passing out, and I've completely just lost my thread. But what we are trying to do is go into the Golden Goose and get uh, and get the banquet table. So apparently it is in here. So let's have a look. I did want to check IDs first because I just didn't want to like have to get tokens. Tokens are a pain to get. So I don't want to get anything with tokens unless I really want it. So like, but maybe that sofa. That's actually quite cool. <laughs> Why she got all this cool stuff? An aquarium. Oh, wow. You can place your favorite fish in here and watch them swim. But this is what we're after. The uh, 100 token banqueting table. Oh, it'll give me 20, 26 defense points just on its own by being there. Nice. So that helps. So I need to kind of have a go at some of these games, I think. Yay, play again. Uh, so we're getting two a time, but it's super fast. Three for that one. Okay, I'm already bored of that. <laughs> Let's try this one. What's this one? So, Space Pilferers. As the game is its end, Frenzy Mode activates. During this time, an extra score bonus will be given. Only one item can be grabbed at a time. Any other item will replace the previously held item. Okay, good to know. Holding the drop button will decide the speed and power of launch. This shows how many points you have. Uh, more points means higher rewards. First, adjust the position of the claw and grab everything you can. Okay, that's, I don't really understand that, but I shall try. You okay, got 10 points for that. 30 points for that. 10 points. I see things like knock each other away. Oh, how much was those green ones? I know, just grab everything, I think. I'm trying to like game the system a bit. I'm trying to work out like, because I clearly they've got different colored bags. Oh, I've got three for that, okay. Probably do a bit better though, couldn't I? 20. 30. The pinks are 30. So the greens are 20. We want to try and get pink and green bags more if we can. Orange bag. We've got some orange ones coming in, or red, ready orange sort of color. Oh, 276. That's better. Okay. 100 going to take a while though, isn't it? Ah, missed it. Oh, 50 for the red ones. Nice. Bag. Red bag. Red bag. Get the red bags. I really feel like this might be more about getting the right bags rather than getting as many as you can. Or maybe a little bit of both, to be honest. 270? Okay. We're getting better at this, kind of. Oh, Mr. Pink one. Red. Another red. Oh, missed that red one. Oh, get that red one. Yeah! Oh no, it fell out! But I grabbed another one on the way back. Oh, this is hard. 
some hard times. Especially when they're on the bottom. Other things get in the way. <laughs> okay, 310. We're getting better, slowly. Quite enjoying this. <laughs> Oh no, I missed the red one! Ah! Oh, oh there's another red one that I missed. <laughs> I could have had like a hundred more by now. Oh man, I'm missing like every red one. <gasps> I got a red one! Yes! <laughs> I'm super happy with myself now. Oh, 370. Okay, yeah, this is better. I didn't even look how many tokens I got. I'm, I'm just like going for the scores here. Uh, oh no. Yes, red one. Ah. I think I'm getting more of these by accident than anything. Ah! 208. That was pretty rubbish, that round. <laughs> so, um... Six there. I don't know how many I've gotten towards... I was having quite a lot of fun there. 65. I want to go and have a little go at uh, Whack-A-Mole. Outside as well. Just so that we can have do something a bit different to that weird game that I've been playing for the li have I been playing that for no I haven't I've been doing other things it's fine <laughs> have I been play been playing that for 15 minutes I've been recording for 15 minutes all right then little moles ah uh, why is no one of them got a time ah okay I think that stops time and these guys I think have Helmets on because you have to hit them twice. Um, why did I decide to go on hard difficulty? <laughs> oh, there's two timer ones now. It says I passed the level at 70, so I figure I'm doing all right. Oh, there's a Q button there. Oh, I can do a spin attack. Oh no, spin to win, spin to win. Let's go, let's go, let's go. These guys, oh, they stun, like the ones with the blocks, they stun me. I'm sure I remember this from the last time I played it. I got an A. Look at me, look at me go. That wasn't so bad. Seems as I haven't played this in like since forever. So yeah, it's pretty easy actually. It seems like uh, clock guys stop time. Helmet guys have need two hits. I I'm not sure what these guys are about. Oh, I've got another. Spin to win, spin to win, spin to win, spin to win, spin to win. Stop time. More spin to win, spin to win, spin to win. I suppose I can afford to be stunned because it's quite a good score at the moment. I've only got, I've still got 21 seconds left as well. It's all right. Score 200. Oh, if you get 200, you get an S and you get eight. Nice. Uh, next level, so level three. I wonder how many levels there are. Oh, 
It's important to grab those clock ones, I think. Keep that time stopped as far as you can. I missed the odd helmet one. I'm not so unhappy with that. I don't think you get any more points for a helmet one. I'm looking though. 100. Oh no, you do get double points. You get double points for helmet ones. You heard it here first. So they are worth getting if you can get them. Wait for some more to pop up and then hit the timer. And then I'll use my Q ability. And stop the clock at the end of it. Okay, so yeah, we got an A in that. We got a bonus of 10 extra. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna try and exit there and I'll see where that brings us to in terms of getting our table. Where does that bring us to in terms of getting our table? We need 15 more, so I think another round or two of grabber. Hi, Arvio. Amazing work up north, Shilab. Say, have you spoken with Katori lately? If she's still working on that amusement park, might be good to lean more towards the space theme, eh? I tell you because she doesn't listen to me anymore. <laughs> See ya. Okay, we want to play space pill for us, Arvio. Out the way. <laughs> and then you can come to our first party. Ah! Oh, it's all gone funny. Ah! Yeah. Can't get those pink and red bags. Not always possible. Oh, I just went into frenzy just as I was trying to get a red bag. Three hundred and thirty. That'll do. <clears throat> that was seven. I need... How many did I need? I forget. It was something like 15, wasn't it? I get all into the mini game. Like I say, I don't like mini games, but I'm getting kind of into these ones. See how I'm doing though now. Where are we on? Nin 97. Right, 97 is going to be a. That's going to be a punch a thon. Okay, done. <laughs> it's faster. It's faster, but it's lower yield, I think. Okay, so now we can get the banquet table. Da 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 da. I am thinking of some of these nice furniture pieces, like that nice wooden wall clock and things might be really nice. I want a really nicely decorated place um, while maxing out my skill points. And that doesn't necessarily mean having like relics and things all over the place. Look, I want to maybe get rid of some of the low value stuff, replace it with high value stuff so I can have a slightly smaller home. That's gonna be that's gonna be the idea, I think, anyway. Okay, so I'm gonna head home. Uh, did I did I buy the? I did buy it, right? Yeah. <laughs> it's the sort of thing I would do. It really, is the sort of thing I would do. Like forgetting to ride my horse home when I have a clear, a perfectly good horse. But yeah, that having a bit of a sort of a half a day in the game center and just looking generally at what furniture I want. I think that was quite good. Okay, so let's edit my home. Go to things I own. And let's put down the banqueting table. Yeah, 
Let's have a little look at it, shall we? So prepare a party. After preparing for your party, you can start sending the invitation letters. You can send these up to two hours before the party starts. Okay. Party tutorial. Oh, perfect. I'm very glad it gave me a tutorial. Put the banquet table in your home and interact with it to start preparing a party. Already done. You can only use one banquet table at a time. Okay. You can only have one normal party per week, but special parties like birthdays and anniversaries, etc. can be held as many times per week as you like. Available dates for the party, available dates for a special party, and then unavailable dates for a party. Okay, so we can have two this week because I've got a birthday. Um, choose the theme, food package, and additional services such as music and fireworks to make your party more exciting. When you organise the party, you'll get party invitations. Invite the citizens of Sandrock to your party by handing out invitation letters. If no guests can attend, the party will be automatically cancelled. Before the day of the party, you can modify the time. Uh, you can cancel the party up to two hours before the party starts. You can place different dishes on the banquet table. You must have the food selected to put it on the banquet table. Uh, okay. So I've got to have it in my hot bar and put it on. So it looks like I can arrange the dishes to start with and then I can actually put extras on while they're eating, I guess. When the party starts, you can turn on or off the music or, fire or use fireworks by interacting with them. After the party, each participant's relationship will improve depending on what food they had. When the party is finished, any leftover food will be sent to your mailbox. Sounds... All right. Okay. So I have, it said I have a birthday coming up. So my birthday is on Monday. So I could actually have a party either today or tomorrow. Magic mirror contract expired. Hmm. So I think Rosie can set the table if I put food into. Honestly, I don't think that that, is, unless Rosie makes the food. I'm not that interested in that. Pen and I have the same birthday. Uh, Banjo's birthday soon. And the dance off is coming up as well. Got cool, lots of stuff. The, the day of memories meerkat's birthday meerkat's birthday will be a good one because meerkat will get like double or triple points for uh, getting a present then okay okay i will try and put one in on saturday Let's do 12 o'clock so I've got some time to prep it first. I'll go and buy food off Owen if I have to. I don't want birthday theme or wedding theme. I want normal theme. And I want... Oh! You can just get like, you can get like a premium food package. A fancy food package. Extras. Fireworks and party music. Why not? I've got money. Let's make it cool. Oh, wow. It gave me all the food. Oh, I'm so much happier with this. Why did Rosie do that? Maybe that's part of Rosie's thing. I don't know. Either way, very happy. Right, so now I've got to do invites. That's the only thing I don't know how to do. Um, so 
Rosie doesn't do any of that. Maybe I can just walk up to them and invite them or something. At the moment, it's all just working out how a party works. And I want to then do myself a, like a birthday party as well. So let's see if I can... Oh, okay. Owen, can I invite you to my party? Interact, play, gift, chat. I'm working on telling the story of your heroism over in the spaceship ruins, but while I'm thinking about taking out the part about the duck, it just seems a bit whimsical in comparison to everything else. I'll just say you built a super jetpack or something. Sound good? No! Don't... Don't take Daisy's part away. Hey, see you around. Alright then, so I have no idea how to invite people. I seem to remember this being an issue in Porsche as well. I can get you just to work out how to invite anybody. So let's just go and ask the internet. Uh, sand rock invite. Oh, are the invites given? Three party table. Okay, right, okay. So maybe I have been given some in my inventory. I have! Yay! <laughs> so let's um let's go. So we're on Friday now, so I can still I give out invitations for a while. So Owen and I want to, to invite you. Coop. Howdy! Let's gift you party invitation. Hmm. Ain't no party like a builder party because a builder party don't stop unless it's that lazy mason. But then again, he never, and I do never, mean never, through a party. <laughs> I love it. Howdy. I've got recipes as well. Oh, a steamed sandfish. Oh, hang on. I wanted to know that one. Did I? Oh, I messed it up, I think. Never mind. <laughs> Owen can come. So who else on my list? Uh, or maybe someone like Vivi. So I, I want to try and invite people that I'm, I've am i not got amazing relationships with. Obviously Owen I really want to have a massively good relationship with. Let's see if Vivi's around. She can come. Jasmine, I want you to come to my party. 100%. So let's see if I'm allowed to. I think so. Uh-huh. Teddy wants to come too. And Vivi. Hello. See now there's a, a I it looks like online there's problems possibly. Although if everyone gets plus four to be invited, then I should invite them anyway. But it, it looks to me like it's, I don't want to invite Heidi or Hugo because they give me a lot of commissions. So I don't think I really need to worry about them too much. Um, like Jensen, like Vivi is already a, a few stars actually. Mian would be a good one if I can find her. Katori would be a really good one. Um, Mort and Zeke might be good. Fang might not be the best actually. And maybe Venti or Andy, if I can find them. I don't know. I'll see who I can find and just give out the invitations as I find people. But there's certain ones that I'm not going to give to because, like, Burgess, for example. I'm doing quite well with Burgess. Chidi, that's not even someone that I need to get. Right, down B. How are you doing? Are you quite low? Ooh, the Danby's actually really high up. Danby's a three. So that might be 
worth doing. Thank you. Invite Riri. I can't. He's off doing stuff right now. He's he's on a he's on a mission. Maybe if I'm better friends with you, I can be better friends with Riri. So we'll see. Who be this? Peck. Faye. Bye. Everyone's gonna go to bed soon, aren't they? See if I can find Katori at all. Yes, nice. So Katori is definitely someone I want to invite to a party. Hello. Hmm. My birthday? Sixteenth of autumn. Don't remind me. Learned a new birthday. Finally, I feel like it's safe to say it's all over. All that's left is to fix this town up, finish that tunnel, and make the desert green again. Then we're back on track to being the jewel of the desert. Oh, I jinxed it, didn't I? Okay, so I want to gift you a party invite. Thank you. Be happy to come to your little soiree. You know, these kind of events are great for networking. Thanks for the invitation. I don't think I have enough seats for everybody, but I don't know if everybody will actually come, so we'll we'll see. And if I get plus four um, for every single person I give an invitation to, plus four social points, then I may as well. Avery, will you come to my party? I already invited Coop. Let's see if uh, Mabel's around. Uh, too late. Okay. How many invites do I have left? I've invited at least six people, I think. I've got four left. So I'll just see if there's anybody running, wandering around. So. Already invited Coop. Let's see if anyone's doing a patrol or anything up here. Okay, Arvio. I've got an okay relationship with Ravio, but I am running out of, uh... Hmm? Can't spell party without Ravio. I guess you can, but why would you? Consider it a deal. I'll be there. Okay. Anyone else around? Doing any patrols or anything? That's Macchiato. I will not give Macchiato a party invite, however, I will give you a spinel. I'll see if I can invite people in the morning, possibly, as well. Might work, might not. Meow! It won't be long before Macchiato is a pet for me. I feel like it's all coming together. Uh, I don't think I can go inside the civil court or anything like that. So, yeah, I'm going to go to bed now, I think. And uh, so I've sort of caught the latecomers. Oh, there's Pablo. Pablo, you want to come to my party? You'd be an ideal person to come to my party. Even if you do keep roasting my skin. He's like, no, that's not me roasting your skin. It's the sun. That's why you need sunscreen. Yeah, that joke fell flat. I'd always thought of it as cliche, but maybe the good guys really do always win in the end. Ah, well done, Sheilab. Nice. So, would you like to come to my party? <laughs> Be there, maybe fashionably late. Okay. Two more invites to give out. I would love to give them to someone like Venti or Andy, if I can. But I don't know whether the people who are that low down will actually come. Well, we'll see who arrives. And then I'll do a birthday party. Heidi, you are the one person that I'm actually not going to invite because you are actually already like my best friend forever and so I don't actually need to try with you, unfortunately. Sad, but it's true. Okay, let's go to bed. And then we've got a couple of hours to, to do the party then. So I've got fireworks, I've got music. Hopefully it should be really cool. You can now go to the Space Center Abandoned Ruins via Daisy near the Moisture Farm. What else did it say there? I'll look at that when I edit. Maybe it'll also give me a piece of mail about all these things. Yay, my party day! 
Time to party! Oh, doesn't it all look so pretty? But I would love it if I could get to the point where things were a little bit nicer looking in the yard itself. Uh, although I just I did decide it was my decision to do the parties first, though. Civil Corps got some good news. With a little help of uh, the Alliance agents, we managed to clear out the Northern Ruins. We can now officially state that the Northern Space Centre Abandoned Ruins is open for business. To get people over safely, the Civil Corps came to a deal with Elsie to provide transport. Go over near the moisture farm and shout quack three times. Daisy will come right over to take you there. On another note, if you can help out with some dried fish to give to Daisy, it'll help us out a whole bunch too, Civil Corps. Okay, so they might have some quests for things. That's the other thing, is if I want to get Justice and Unsure and them to like me a bit more, then I should check out the Civil Corps quests a bit more. I do a lot of commission board quests. Um, I should have a look at those as well. Because Owen's got a couple of quests. And so does Grace. I think I will take all of those. 4,000 for that one. 1,000 for that one. I'll take all of those. Should I take the one for Heidi as well? I uh, can't take that one. I think I've got one outstanding for like cactus stuff for Trudy. And I really do want Trudy to be my friend. So I'm going to be trying to invite Trudy to parties as well. And I'm going to have to try and start being a little bit more uh, discerning about who I invite. So what I might do is I'll make my party invites a couple of days in the future. Obviously I wanted to test this one out. I've just walked all over the food. Oops. Uh... <laughs> I wanted to test this one out nice and early. I really did because I wonder how we're going to get 10 people in around six seats. Mm. But I wanted to try it out nice and early so that uh, I could see the party and see how it worked and everything. So let's see. Uh, can I maybe find someone like us? Uh, get lightning out quickly because it'll take me forever otherwise. I'll go and see if I can find someone like Trudy around, who I really do struggle to get to know. Or maybe even someone like Andy. I'm looking for people who I generally don't seem to get commissions from, I don't have a lot of like storyline missions with, and it's been a bit of a struggle to get them up in liking of me. Yeah, Trudy's there, let's see if we can invite her. And also Crystal and Pebbles. I don't know how how it will work with children. Thank you. I'll keep the speeches to a minimum. A party's a great chance for me to get down and really listen to the people. Lovely. So I want to have a look because Crystal does sometimes give commissions and things. So she might actually be further up the the tree than I thought. Um, no, on a two. So Crystal would be an ideal one. I'm just trying to get all the people that. Thank you. Of course I'll come. Hardly ever get a chance to have some fun. I'll take every opportunity that comes my way. Just gotta hire a sitter. Well, I didn't invite Rocky, so like he can just sit. <laughs> That's so mean of me, isn't it? Banjo and Macchiato. So Banjo um, might like an opal today, possibly. Macchiato, stop running away, please. I have a present for you. Opal today. Still, getting that, getting that over that buddy line is, is a struggle. Like, I give a good 20, 30 points worth, and it looks like it's really close to the edge of the star, and it's like, it's just not. So if I have a little look at Macchiato now, Macchiato is, like, so close. It must, it's got to be next episode. And Meerkat is kind of looking the same as well, so... We shall see. I haven't seen Meerkat today. But I might need to think of a little name for Meerkat, maybe, because Meerkat is just a Meerkat. <laughs> Do I keep him? I should call him Sergey. <laughs> Would that be like, I might be like leaning on certain copyrights though, so maybe I shouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Okay, well I've given out all my invites. We've got another couple of hours before it starts. Um, I think everything's done for it, which is wonderful. I can start on my commissions a little bit, maybe. So we'll get them sort of semi-started. And once we've done the party, and then maybe there might be another party next time, because as I say, my birthday is on Monday. Put the calendar there. So we've got one on Saturday. We're going to have one next episode as well on the Monday. And then I could probably have another one next Saturday or Sunday if I want to. So I could just keep having parties. As long as I keep doing enough commissions to fund said parties, cool. that should be a fast way to do to do things. Oh, people are turning up, look. That's mighty pretty. Interesting. Okay, Lightning, I would like you to go in your stable. So beautiful. Banjo. Wow, this is really cool. I'm just gonna pet you. Because I love you. I do. Just a quick one though. Oh, oh so many of them came. Jasmine came, Cooper came, o Owen and Pablo. Pablo is stuck behind my notice board. Oh, good. Crystal, Arvio, Vivi, they all came. Sorry about the lack of seats. I think they do wander between courses though. So um, hopefully they'll just sit, get something to eat. Oh, they're all having a good look around. That's so cute. It's lovely to have all these people here. So beautiful. I love how they're like so beautiful. I'm like, Aww. hopefully when the party starts at twelve, I'll be able to turn on the party music, and then we can set off fireworks and things. I think that might be where I'm allowed to set off the but I'd probably have to wait for it to start properly. Oh that's pretty. Interesting. So if I can have a party every week. Hey, party time. Oh look the fireworks are going off. Amazing. They have so hot and sour the fish. So good. Oh. oh, they're all liking so the hot and sour fish, apparently. Yeah. I'm so glad I didn't have to <laughs> cater this myself. Delicious. I'll be interested if I get this banquet Whoa. table earlier so on tasty. in my full playthrough. I'll be interested to see like whether I it caters itself or whether the catering is coming through Rosie. I'm not 100% sure myself. Whoa, uh, this tastes well, great. I can stand up and have a bit of a nom as well, so that's fine. So I had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so good. Oh, Trudy's having a wonder. Nine people, and I invited ten. Amazing. Oh, crystals. Somehow stuck in the in the pen. I'm glad that uh, she managed to get out of there. Whoa, this tastes great. Hip, hip, hooray! They're really enjoying it, aren't wow, they? This is really cool. Just trying to take pictures of like party time. That, wow, this is really cool. Have a chat. Man, I just wish you came here sooner. There's so many people not around anymore who really would have liked to have met you. My pa would have loved seeing that workshop of yours. <laughs> Don't get me started. Well, you and I are going out on a play date tomorrow, I think. I'm sad I missed that recipe earlier, but never mind. I hope they're enjoying this. I hope they're enjoying all the extras I paid oh, for. That's pretty. But did I invite pebbles? I think I might have done. Or maybe Crystal brings pebbles anyway. But I do love the fact that pebbles and Andy are around to keep Jasmine company now though. Because I, I always felt so sorry for poor little Jasmine at the beginning when she was the only kid in town. I was like, oh, 
That's so sad. So it seems like they just sit down and they... Oh right, I see. So we've run out of food. I'm still a little bit hungry. Arrange the dishes. Ah, right, okay. Let's see if I can put anything else on the table for them. Out of my food box. So this is the point where I can sort of put things on there for them. It starts off with 18 dishes. And then I can give them extra. Cooking. Okay, so we've got some omelettes. Got some steamed sandfish and some high wind fried rice. Well, I guess that's what I'm putting on then. Didn't realise that would be a thing, but that's why we're having this. This is basically, for me, a practice party. And that would also probably be where um, the party catering would, would go. Anything's left over at the end. I don't know how much they'll like those dishes. Wow, um, really cool. But it's probably better to give them food than to give them nothing, right? Well, this party is lasting a long time. Oh, that is something fancy. But if it's a way of getting like wow, this is 10 really points cool. with like 10 people, you're suddenly getting 100 points with people, then it's probably worth doing for the sake of once a week, taking some time out for this. And it's not like I can't spend time, and I probably should be actually doing like, doing other things. I should also talk to them as well. Howdy. Does it look like I'm missing something to you? If you guessed sunscreen, you're right. Check out what you've won. The once in a lifetime opportunity to get me one, please. So I must have sunscreen somewhere, right? If it, it... Wow, look at all that. 26 with Katori, 12 with most other people. Thanks for having um, me. I was See looking ya. for sunscreen. It was fun. Had a good one. Katori wanted sunscreen, and, and literally all Pablo has been giving me for ages is sunscreen. Today was fun. Oh, face cream, sunscreen. Yeah. Tori, come back hey, here, wherever so you are. Later now. Thanks for having me. I've got you some sunscreen. Yeah. Huh. You're a real, real winner. Oh, thank you. Yes, I know. So let's have a little look now. So my social, hopefully, with everybody is just that little bit better. So a lot of people have, like, gone up the rankings. Katori is now very close to being a uh, friend. So it's Cooper, Meerkat, Macchiato, Crystal, still. Oh, Crystal actually went over into buddy territory there. And so did Trudy. Which now means I can start taking the, I believe, start taking them out on days out. I think that shows like a day out. So I think, yeah. So that's showing I've given her a gift. Like I can't spar with her. Or maybe I can, I don't know. Um, but yeah, as soon as you get to buddy, you can start going out on these dates, on these play dates. So that's something I'm going to start doing with a lot of them. Um, so I, Pebbles actually got quite a lot out of that as well, look. Went from being like nothing to being a little bit of a star. So I think I'm going to try and get like Pebbles, Andy, Ryan, when Ryan is back from Mort, Zeke. Jasmine is getting close to being a buddy, which means that I'll be able to take her out on, on dates as well. And so is Katori, so like... 
all of those guys. I need to just keep talking to them and things like that. And maybe try to give them gifts if I can. But yeah, that was amazing. But it's all these people that are like low down the list that I need to take to parties. And then the rest I can just start slowly nipping. Slowly nipping around them and taking them out on play dates. And then hopefully that will really work well. So, hello, Jasmine. Would you like a shiny rock? Wow, what a gift. You do. So shiny, big fan of shiny stuff I am. You got this out of the ground, that's crazy. Aunt Heidi says that we need to make sure we're protecting the earth. But we can get these all super, so, sorry, but we can get all these super cool things out of it still. I'll have a chat. Mm. My birthday is the 18th of winter. I try to be good, so maybe one day I'll get that pony I've been asking for. Ah, so that's what we need for like the 25 point uh, present. Pony. <laughs> I always had a bad feeling about Minister Matilda. She was always kind of mean to my ma. Plus she made me eat Burgess's weird oatmeal stuff on Sundays. Ugh. I'd say charge her for that crime too, but you know. Space. <laughs> she is in space, indeed. Could also play critters. Just doing all the things I can to sort of get any points with them whatsoever. I think Jasmine is caning me at this one. Ah. Do I still get? Let's play again. I'm gonna go fox. I'm gonna go elephant. I'm gonna go elephant again. Ah, uh, Jasmine wins. Play again. Elephant. Cat. Mouse. Fox. I won! <laughs> okay. Plus seven. I like playing critters with you. You're good. Till next time. Nice. So that really helped Jasmine. I got about 14 points with her there. Yeah. She's getting close to being a bud. Definitely. But Mia, Cat and Katori are still ahead of her and Macchiato and Coop. So Coop is ahead of Macchiato in buddy -ness. But all these guys are so close. It's not even funny. I do need to find Coco and give them a tomato though, don't I? As well. So anyway, that was good. Banjo. Would you like an opal? <laughs> Nemo, would you like some dog food? Mm. Oh, you know something I forgot to do and I probably should have done before I did that party, but we're going to do it now, is uh, points uh, into social. So, is there anything that helps me with parties? Now I know what a party is. Hangout knowledge. Party knowledge. After a party, gain two more relationship with attendees. And you can have one more party a week. Yes and yes. I would like both of those. Mini game knowledge. Alright, extra tokens. I might want that eventually. But definitely the party and the hangout stuff. Um, shopping... 30% uh, chance to reduce small gifts. Must have a larger purchases when buying goods that buy the stairs. Nah, I don't need that. Double social knowledge EXP gained from interacting with town folks in day-to-day -day life increased by 10%. Uh, every week you can fulfill one more wish. When you fulfill a wish, gain one additional favour from them, their friends and their family. I need to do more wishes uh, next time around. Civil core, 10% less money. So that's just money, and money can be got easily for me anyway. As much as I need money, I uh, there's other things that are more important. So I think the hangout stuff is going to be the next stuff I'm going to go for. So 
So we'll do lots of hangouts, lots of parties. Like extra for commissions was always a no-brainer early on. The add more rep provides 10% extra reputation. Five percent work set reputation, placing in top three in the work. So that makes sense to get orders will receive ten percent more goals and experience. Yeah, it all makes what I've taken so far is made has made sense. Um, but if I want to put more into like chatting and stuff into the actual social side, that might be good. Letter from the developers. Your party has ended. There are still some leftovers on the table. Below is all the stuff you had left over. Lovely. So that can all go out uh, on my birthday party. So I need to go to my cooking chest. Pop those back in. I think they'll sort all because we had quite a lot of stuff there. Actually, I need to make that dew into water as well. Quickly. But yeah, I really enjoyed that party. That was really good. I always put my water into the helper chest. If I need any for farming, I just take that back out. Uh, Rosie, would you like a condensed power stone? Oh, I, sat, I sat down at my banquet table. But yeah, a lot of stuff that we're still wanting to do. I'm still trying really hard to... I want to get all of Rosie's chips eventually. Although I can't find that pet chip. I've no idea where that's going to be. Huh. Would you like a processor or a high-speed processor, maybe? Let's have a little look at what that would do. What? Thank you, Master. There is nothing I love receiving more than objects resembling my own flesh. Perhaps I can even assimilate with this to better serve you. 16 points! Rosie will be my friend in two minutes. I'm going to be in those northern spaceship ruins <laughs> digging up high-speed processors. I expect normal processors will probably be quite good as well but not as good as the high speed ones probably but this is the point in the game where i can pretty much get anything that a person wants if i know they want it okay well we are at like nearly an hour in so i am wondering whether just to sort of cap it off having done all of the stuff we need for that party but probably first i think i do want to set up something for these commissions so i need to make a titanium wow okay you know i was saying that the essential sword and shield was probably the highest you can't even use the titanium one until you're level 45. Uh, so methinks that might be quite a high level one then So this is, oh, and I have all the stuff for it. Just sat there already. Nice. So I will build that, lovely. That's like three grand straight off the bat. So uh, also, um, I need to check and see if that diamond ring is better than what I've got. It is, it's better than the bone earring. And the Spinal Corsage will be better once I'm a higher left level for it. Also, the Diamond Ring could possibly be upgraded. So could Lumi's Brooch. Good to know. Very good to know. And like I said, I can still get another 90-odd defense just from putting things in my house. Right, so next. Uh, Rhino Horn Cactus. Can't do that. That's on its way. That's being done. So... Track that, track that. So it's limestone and petrified wooden stick. I very much expect I don't have the stuff for that and I need to go and make it. Let's have a look. Petrified wooden stick. For mission, I need five. <laughs> I do not have enough wood for that. Limestone bricks, I usually don't have enough limestone. I can make one and I need seven for my mission. <laughs> Okay, so what I will do 
just before the end of the episode then is I'll go and do a very quick I'm not even well no I should take lightning I put lightning back in the stable for the party but um, I should go very quickly to the bend and grab all the limestone I can there before I go to bed and very quickly then go out to the uh, gecko uh, station ruins around that area to grab myself some wood See, I have a mount whistle. I always forget that. We'll do the bend first. I'm more likely to be able to find enough wood if I run out of time. But the limestone, I kind of need that to regenerate. So it should tell me how, exactly how much I need. So I'm going to need a total of 28 and I have four so far. So that's good to know. It never hurts to pick up um, a gate while I'm here. Because that's a very useful thing for upgrading um, to rare certain certain weapons and things like that. I forget. I think it was um, certain tools and weapons. I think it was my pick hammer needed it, for example. Rosemary bush, clover bush. I'm going to pick these up because I don't think I've picked these up before and it'd probably be a, a new learning point. Yeah, I thought so. Even if I don't pick the whole thing up. Right, okay. Let's keep looking for limestone. Well, there's some moonstone, so that's a good start. Where's my pick hammer? <laughs> that would be another good start, wouldn't it? Pick hammer and axe. I moved them all out of the way so I could uh, put party food in there. But now it is time to get back to work. Partying has been done. I'll probably need to go and get some more opals soon as well for the for the Kit Kats. So this is the reason I'm here today as well as I probably will come back tomorrow. Uh, is that quite often there isn't enough limestone in one day just to cover the entire thing so I should probably come out here more often and gra gather limestone just because but I'm particularly bad at going around places and gathering just because I tend to prefer to gather when I actually need something which sometimes does bite me in the bum but it's uh, it's just how I am you know lightning this would be faster on you wouldn't it so places I found limestone before in all the little nooks and crannies really I think that that snake might be after me here's some and sometimes in between all the rocks up there I find some as well so we're on 17 out of 28 if I can get 28 I'll be happy oh yeah we have okay cool 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 If I do see more, I will grab it just so that next time it's not so difficult. Yeah, there is some up here as well. So that was another place that I could always find a bit of limestone. It's up here. But it needs time to respawn. So I can't take limestone quests like all the time. And this is why I did this one first is because we are starting to run out of time now. So I will be going back to my home. I'll be putting these in the furnace and then tomorrow we'll go and find all the petrified wood, I think. But I had a feeling that I wouldn't find enough limestone, so I thought, well, I'll come out here first and we shall see. Desert Viper. That's an interesting one. Maybe I should have stopped to kill him, but I'm kind of running out of time right now. I want to get back home in plenty of time to have a good night's sleep. And then... Uh, Tomorrow we've got another party to set up, so I'm going to be setting up my birthday party. We'll have a birthday party theme and everything, which is why I haven't spent my money. You may have noticed I haven't spent my money on recipes, and it's because I want to keep it and make sure I've got enough for my birthday. Okay, let's see. Let's go back to here. I will sign off for the day. I think that was a really good, fun episode looking into parties. I really enjoy doing that. So we, uh, and it, and it really worked out well. I mean, it must have been a good, 
well, 120 points, 100, probably a good 130, 140 points worth of overall stuff for the uh, overall social points for the town. You do that like 10 times, that's a, a whole star for each one of them. All right. Time to sleep and time to say goodbye to you guys though. So I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.